What's up? Jason Young, Improvement Warrior Fitness, LBN, OnlineFitness.com. Welcome back. This is the first two mobilizations working on the archetype of the hip hinge and the squat. Okay? So, first mobilization is the hip capsule mobilization. All right, so what you're going to need, you're going to need a band. Okay? We have it attached to this pipe. If you don't have a band, go get a set of bands from the band man, Dave Schmitz. Link is down below. He's got some great stuff. So this is quantum band, we uh, average band, green band. You can go one up to the blue band or one down to the purple band, just depending on where you are okay? and how strong you are and how much you weigh and all that stuff. So basically, you're going to put the band right into your groin area, come down to bulldog type position, come away from the wall as to put as much tension as you need. Okay, start small and then work your way up from there. Okay, and then basically with full breathing capacity, breathing in through your diaphragm and exhaling fully, you're just going to be oscillating back and forth, moving up a little bit, trying to find the areas you're a little tighter. Okay, and this usually isn't where I'm tight, I'm a little more tighter on the back side of my hamstrings, which is the next one, which I'll show you next. Okay. Once you find an area, stay there. Breathe. Fully exhale. Again, breathing through the diaphragm, through your belly, and letting it all out. Okay. Typically, you spend two minutes on each side. Okay. All right, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to show you but you would do two minutes on each side and get a timer because two minutes doing these types of things is, seems like an eternity because a lot of them do hurt and the more it hurts the more you probably need it not hurt hurt but you'll get the uh, you'll get the point when you do it okay so it's really starting to burn right in that hip capsule right in there okay so it's basically pulling your hip capsule back into the proper position. All right, so that's hip capsule mobilization. All right, you would do two minutes on each side. The next one is the one-legged down dog flexion. Okay. my other leg for this one. This one, you're going to bring it up right onto your hip flexor, okay? and then you're going to come forward, okay, just as far as you can, all right, and then you're going to extend the leg that the band is on, okay, fully extended, okay, so if you need to move back towards the wall, that'll be a little easier the further out you come the harder it's going to be because you have to uh, flex against more band tension. Okay? And fully exhale as you extend. Come down. Try and keep your back arched. Try not to round the back. Typically you'll do 30 to 40 reps on each side here. Okay? And let's get you a different angle. And that is it. And then after each mobilization, you would just want to retest. So feet relatively together. You can have a fist, fist length between your feet if you want. Come down. Legs relatively straight. Okay. Should be at 90 degrees. Uh, that looks about 90 there. Or below. Okay. Again, if you have to bend your legs too much, okay, or your back starts rounding, then you do not pass that the hip hinge squat archetype. So that's it. Let me know what you think. Don't forget subscribe, like, share, comment, all that good stuff. I'll see you next time. Stay strong, stay positive, be the improvement warrior.